everyone, we are from SACSS. My name is Rihanna. I'm Megan. My name is Jason. And I am Gail. My name is Charlotte. My name is Chloe. And my name is Kirsty. We would like to ask you a few questions. The first question is, what kind of difficulties or challenges do you face in the orchestra? And how long have you been playing your instruments? Hey, my name is Ng Pei Sien, and I'm the principal cellist of the Singapore Symphony Orchestra. Greetings to all the Sec 1 students from St. Anthony's Canosian Secondary School. I wish you all the best in your studies during these difficult times. And thank you for tuning in to our National Day concert. So one of the biggest challenges we face as orchestra players is teamwork. And what I mean by that is it's quite regular for 60 or more of us to be playing and rehearsing together at the same time. And each of us have our own ideas, opinions, and our own minds with our own experiences. We've all dedicated and devoted our entire lives to classical music. So our job is to play as one and to find a collected and uh, unified approach to a work which is, of course, um, facilitated by the conductor. If we can all learn to respect each other and work together, we can really accomplish some amazing things. So I would say teamwork is very important. Now, the second question was how long I've been playing the cello for? And I would say it's been a really long time. And, and I haven't stopped loving it, I would say. Uh, I started when I was five and a half, and I picked up the piano when I was seven and a half. So I've been playing definitely for longer than any of you have been alive. Now, I want to finish there and thank you all for your questions and for tuning into our concert. Thank you so much and hope to see you in the concert hall at some point in the future. Bye! I believe we have some questions for the half how many people usually play the harp in the orchestra? And why do you guys usually get this harp? Hello everyone, thank you so much for your questions. My name is Bulnara Mashurova and I'm a principal harpist with the Singapore Symphony Orchestra. To answer your questions, there are usually only one harp position in the orchestra. However, we do have a substitute list and they usually help me out when we need a two harps to play. Uh, your second question was regarding the blisters. How come we get blisters? Well, we don't really get blisters all the time. We only get them when we haven't been practicing or when we have lots of glisses to play. Thank you so much for all your questions and have a great day. Bye-bye. And we have some questions for the Do you guys only play that one specific instrument? And if, if you would give advice to the younger percussionists, what would it be? Hey guys, thanks so much for your questions. My name is Mark Suter and I'm the Associate Principal Percussionist of the Singapore Symphony Orchestra. Um, so yes, I am a percussionist and you play lots and lots of things and I'm just going to give you a quick tour of the studio so you can see all the instruments that we play as percussionists. Mm. So quite a lot of stuff, right? Um, and I think the advice that I could give to a young musician, percussionist, would be this. There's only three things that you need to know in life. One, good sound. Get a good sound of what you're playing. Two, placement. Placement means your inner rhythm or pulse. And three, your musicality. Who are you as a person? So those three things, if you can do all of those three things well, you're going to have much success. Great sound, placement, and musicality. All the best to you guys. Bye! We would like to ask a few questions for the conductor. How do you, as a conductor, conduct different instruments at the same time? Do you feel like a wizard when you're singing the one? Hey, what's up, guys? First up, a very big hello to all of you at St. Anthony's Canosian Secondary School. I would also like to thank you for having watched the 2020 Singapore Symphony Orchestra National Day Concert. 
My name is Daryl Ang, and I was the conductor for that concert. Next, I'd like to say a very big hello to two special friends, Rihanna and Megan, for having left me with two very interesting questions to which I would like to attempt to answer now. The first question comes from Rihanna, and she would like to know how I am able as a conductor to conduct so many instruments at once. Well, Rihanna, when you conduct an orchestra, you need to be able to multitask. And for example, when I'm conducting an orchestra, I am doing at least three things at once. The first thing is listening. I am listening to the orchestra and I'm reacting to what is happening. Secondly, I am communicating with the orchestra, not just with my hands, but especially with my eyes. And then thirdly, I am also thinking ahead. I'm thinking at least four or five bars ahead because I need to know beforehand what I would like to get out of the orchestra and therefore I need to know what I'm going to do. So you see that if you put all these three elements together, it's, it's quite a lot of work that I'm doing at any one moment when I'm conducting an orchestra. The second question comes from Megan and she wants to know if I as a conductor, feel like a wizard with my wand when I'm conducting an orchestra. Yes, Megan, it's a very special feeling. It's a great feeling. And I cannot recommend it too highly because I think it's, the, it's, it's something that you would have to try yourself. It's magical. It is really like a wizard with his wand. When I conduct an orchestra and I feel the flood of sound that emerges from the orchestra, that is a wonderful feeling. That kind of feeling you don't get anywhere else, and it's impossible to put into words, except that it's like magic, and really, you gotta try it. So when you have an opportunity, get a baton, get some friends together, and start conducting. It's amazing. So that's all I have for you now, guys. Thank you for your questions, and enjoy your week ahead. I would like to thank and honour the musicians, Principal Chalice Ang Pei Sien, Principal Hafiz Gunara Meshuova, Associate Principal Percussionist Mark Suter, as well as the conductor Daryl Ang for taking the time to answer the questions of our students. Thank you very much and I hope you have enjoyed the music online learning journey. May God bless you every day.